So when you want a shake of can of spray paint, of course, old, the way I used to do is just shake it by hand, you know, but that gets your arms a little bit tired and it takes quite a long time. If you have an old can of spray paint or several cans of spray paint, or even maybe even one can of spray paint, it's actually faster and a lot easier to do it this way. Just take a reciprocal saw, tape, I take a 12 inch blade, it's a long blade, I think it's 12 inches long. I take two three inch hose clamps and fasten it to the spray can, spray paint, and then keep your hands away from the blade, of course, and just turn it on. Do that for a little bit. Then I take the battery out, take the battery out. And of course, just take, loosen up all my, hope my hose clamps. Loosen up the hose clamps to take the can of spray paint off. And it's, uh, like I say, it's a lot easier. I especially like this on old cans of spray paint because they take longer to shake up. Um, or if you have several cans of spray paint, it definitely saves you a lot of time and it saves your arm too. And you hear the ball rattle and you shake it and it's all ready to go. Just kind of a you neat little hack or something I found out a long time ago. So it works pretty good. I like it. It seems kind of strange. First time I tried it, I thought, would this really work or not? Hey, it works. So you may want to give it a try sometime. Just don't be careful how tight you make the hose clamp though. You want it snug, but don't make it so tight that you want to start crushing the can or anything. I've never done that, but you probably could. I just make it nice and snug just so it can't slip and it seems to work really great. So there we go. <laughs>